Boss, the boss, the boss, the boss. I'm too persistent with income and no cash. Get it on my own, no collab. Yeah. Yeah. People are telling him to buy my line jazz. Now they're building right now. We've got Strands featuring Digger D. Was against the world remix, fam. Okay. You see, bro, I'm telling you, when I add stuff to my um, music playlist and everything, it's like I don't even look at the team properly. I just see the names and just add the track and that, bro. So I get surprised. So yeah, I listened to like three of Strands' song and I like the fact that he came out like not too long ago on that blood, but he's came like his kept the same consistent style in them thing there bro you know what i'm saying and i've heard this track quite cold now he's on the remix brought the right person on it as well man you know what I mean? so yeah let's get into this one let's see what i go on this is going to be interesting bro see how diggity approaches this because he's a man of many styles fam you know eh? Like this right now, but I feel like over the years and that blood, there's been like certain sounds that people drag from the past and bring into the future and that blood. You know what I mean? And now it's the 2000 sound. Same thing with Kowali when Ki when he came up with Let It Rip, bro. Then brought Clavish and Thingy. Even Clavish when it was on Tiffany Clavish thing and that I'm rapping over 2000s beats and them thing that like 50 Cent G Unit type vibes and them thing that. You know what I'm saying? But what people are doing it right though. This ain't just like the sampling thing and people are just sampling whatever and that like these men are doing it right, man. Around me, huh? Shout out to the melanin. Destined for a celly, I would hustle heavy, tryna be a legendary, but I got a man sherry, Julio Don Perry, Pricey Boss Lady, I'll give you old school loving love we in the A's. I know your friends hate me, but they just wanna love me. I'll Jeez. put you all my money. Have. Even the way the format in the bars and that bro, cause I was listening to um a video popped up him I recommended how Jay-Z is in the studio and people basically explaining how he is in that blood, and that made me go and see um man like Lil Wayne's process as well. There's literally the channel, I can't remember what the channel's called, but they show you and like they'll take like examples from Eminem, Jay-Z, all of these guys and, and they'll tell you how these rappers are in the studio, bro. I mean, I was listening to a Lil Wayne, I was like, bro, no one raps like this no more because the way they used to format the bars back in the 2000s, they did it in a certain type of way and that a man like Lil Wayne is one of the most unique rappers when he comes up with his punchlines and that. And this doesn't give me like Lil Wayne punchline type of vibes, but in terms of the way he's formatting his bars though, bro, it gives me that 2000s type of vibe, man. You know what I mean? You see the killers and dealers around me But I grew up with gorillas, you know how the wild be Grew up in the ghetto, destined for a celly I would hustle heavy, tryna be a legendary But I got a man sherry, Julio Don Perry Pricey boss lady, I'll give you old school Loving like we in the A's I know your friends hate me, but they just wanna love me oh, I put you even the melodies when we sober and we Higher than a sauna, I'm a slam in a sober car We die for the closure, I mean Us against the world, us against the ghetto Us against the police, us against I say over against his help. Ho, oh, like you know what I'm saying? Even the way his format and ad libs and the melodies, when we start 50 cent type of vibe, man. Now nah, he did this right. He did it, and this is what I'm saying. When guys do it right and actually pay homage properly and that you know what I'm saying? Like you're seeing the similarities in the styles and them thing there, bro. You know what I'm saying? Come on, man. I'm on a very dark road, can you show me the light? I'm the man, I should be the one that's holding you tight But understand, my paranoia's getting worse at night Cold sweats, I can't sleep, I need you by my side But I got errands that I've gotta run Get ready if you wanna come My key are bags of washing and I'm dropping them off to my mum Fill my car with petrol, it's not diesel, use the other I can't sleep, I need you by my side But I got errands that I've gotta run Get ready if you wanna come My key are bags of washing and I'm dropping them off to my mum Wait, big man like Diggy D dropping bags of Ikea bags to your mum's yard and that to do you what? Come on, people, man. Bro, I lived in Africa where every single day after school, I would literally have to wash my uniform. There were some days where I literally went to school with dirty socks and that because I could not be bothered washing, bro. You know, hand wash, bro. There's one time I was in assembly and my teacher literally pulled me out and made the whole school look at my socks, bro, and was like, ha ha. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like Nelson and Simpson and them thing there, bro. You know how embarrassing that was in that, bro? Because every single morning you basically do the national anthem and that, like, the Gambian national anthem and them thing there. You know what I'm saying? But then one of the 
lines is like you're basically going to visit the president and the teacher was taking a piss out of me saying yeah this guy's going to see the president with dirty socks and everything I'm like bro chill out man like you're not saying and bro, all you have to do is just dash him in the washing machine little liquid here little liquid there hang them out and you're done and that bro like come on now people man we're getting too lazy I get it superstar lifestyle and that upper echelon life and that you don't have to bro but come on now man you know I'm right? a petrol stop diesel use the other pump I knew from when I seen you you ain't nothing like them other ones spilling up some petrol stop diesel use the other pump I knew from Man, is Diggity trying to grow his beard, blood? My thing, man said man's trying to get the beard gift. <laughs> I feel you, I feel you, you Blake. Yeah, yeah. Like them other ones, spilling up some weed, control the stern with my knees. I look at you and smile and see you staring back at me. Mm. You made me feel at ease, I'm kinda stressed, so be my peace. I really wanna leave, I hate it here. Let's go to Greece, wait, or we can go to Paris, babe. But I like it in Sancho I know you never heard of it, but this is where the richest stay. I don't care what you say, I'm still gonna grip it in the States. They know we grip it, DSB, I left the five palm tape. Us against the world, us against the ghetto, us against the police, us against this hell. I went fully legend on the day that you found me. I know you see the killers and dealers around me. But I grew up with gorillas, you know how the wish be. Us against the world, us against the ghetto, us against the police, us against this hell. Dumber like you go, baby, can't you tell? I ain't hit another song, I ain't bought another show. It's us against the world, us against the ghetto, us against the police, us against this hell. Dumber like you go, baby, can't you tell? I ain't hit another song, I ain't bought another show. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Murder that. Murder that. Murder that, bro. Murder that, blood. You know what I'm saying? Come on, now, okay. Murder that. Shout out Strands, blood. Not gonna lie, Diggity might have took the back seat on that one still, bro. It's just the style, man. That was 50 Cent esque right there, bro. 50 Cent would be proud of that, man. I can't even lie to you. Shout out Strands. I'm liking his style. And like I said, when I like went back into his catalogue and that, bro, I didn't really like listen to like every single tune. I just like turned on a tune, skipped around a bit, but his style has been consistent ever since and that, bro. So I feel like he seems comfortable. I don't think this is just going to be like a moment and now he falls off type of thing. I feel like he's comfortable in this space and everything there. So shout out to him. Shout out to Digga D. Perfect makeup. I'll make sure I say, bro, you know what I'm saying? Um, or acquirization and everything there in terms of Digga D because Diggity's he's been doing the 50 cent thing and that bro he's made a multitude of tunes and that blood you know I'm saying sampling his thing and that bro but yeah shout out to Shanti he did this thing properly and like I said the cadence the way he was flowing the ad lipping and that the melodies that he was doing 50 cent esque bro you know I'm saying he spun this one differently hopefully you man enjoyed it's your boy and Jazz and I'm gone in a bit people man